Earth signs, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus. What I'm seeing here actually could be very empowering for you because this stalemate might actually be a good thing since you've moved on from a situation that might have been a third party. We do have the Seven of Swords here. There was deception, cheating, lies going on here. I feel you've evolved from that and you're really ready to move forward onto healthy partnerships and connections. But the interesting thing too, because for my Divine Feminines, you're coming in as the High Priestess, I feel whoever it is that you detached from in this third party, they're still yearning for you. They're still thinking about you, possibly missing the intimacy between the two of you. And I don't just mean the sexual part of it. You know, they're just missing your company. This fear card here, I feel that was something that you might have dealt with in the past and you're no longer in that energy, I feel. You've moved on from that. And then we've got the Emerald of Water message here. It says it's time to go with the flow of where life and love want to take you. Being rigid and closed-minded prevents you from growing and finding the many blessings that are meant for you. Remove stagnancy, stubbornness, and stalemate type situations from your journey. Love yourself enough to see that you are a gem with so much to offer to the world and to the one who was meant for you. And that's exactly what you did.